Questions were raised during AFTEC briefing of the C5A Phase 1 OUE results regarding the effects of weather on C5A off-pavement capabilities. As a result, AFTEC was tasked to evaluate C5A operations, taxi, towing, and offload on soil surfaces covered by snow. Testing in snow was conducted at Griffiths Air Force Base, New York from 20 through 23 January 1981. The test was managed by AFTEC and the aircraft and test personnel were furnished by the Military Airlift Command. Snow depth on the test area averaged 12 to 14 inches. The maximum depth recorded was 21 inches in a narrow strip parallel to the taxiway from which the test runs began. During the test, approximately one inch of new snowfall was recorded. Taxi runs consisting of straight line taxi, 90 degree turns, and 180 degree turns at increasing nose wheel steering angles were conducted at 450,000, 560,000, and 665,000 pounds. The aircraft performed satisfactorily in 12 to 14 inches of snow using only moderate power. The offload of wheeled, tracked, and palletized cargo posed no problems and was limited only by the capability of the vehicles to negotiate in the snow when moving away from the aircraft. 